um, and it's really nice to with a lot of masculines waking up you know sometimes masculine might want to work with a masculine and and I think it was really important for us to really sort of you know help and assist all these beautiful masculines coming online now um, you know there's masses and masses of women that have oh, the feminine physicality um, that are, are already sort of online but there's um, you know the masculine need assistance too you know and and not to suppress your emotion you know it's really important yeah that's it i'm realizing a lot of but i think this was something i was thinking about earlier on actually is this idea of like coming into this particular lifetime if your soul decided that you were going to ascend to a higher level of consciousness in this lifetime your soul knew that you had to come in more sensitive and so as a man like i would just say it's okay to get in touch with your emotions and to kind of be okay with balancing that masculine and feminine feminine polarity inside of yourself traditional traditional gender roles are limiting in some ways mm. i don't like speaking in absolutes but yeah just just be mindful and honor that part of you that is more sensitive because that sensitivity is there for a reason and it's not a bad thing you can still have your strength as a man and still do everything you need to do and have your directness and your passion and your core masculinity that's fine but honor that other human part of you that is your emotional state as well yeah definitely gone away with this the uh, words of big boys don't cry like, <laughs> come on in, you know express yourselves you know this yeah. is, you know our next generation you know yeah. um you know mothers out there grandparents out there you know um in you know empower these children to express themselves you know it's important expressing your emotions and getting in touch with your emotions will actually make you stronger as a, as a man and as a leader